Hello everybody, I'm Strategist Primus, and we're back with more Blackfires. This is episode 2, so if you haven't seen episode 1 yet, a lot gets done in it. I highly suggest going back and watching, uh, not just to generate more few time for me, uh, but because a lot of things happen in that which uh, greatly affect what we're doing here. Damon has won the rebellion. It's the Black Dragon triumphant over the Red. That means we need to vigorously uh, try to keep the realm together. There we go. Sorry about that. Now, at the moment, the realm is all kind of shattered and things because it, Mega War System is still uh, calibrating for a victory in the war. So I'm going to let time tick. And there we go. Alright, now I have to go deal with all of these uh, various loyalists to the Targaryens. First we have the Royces. I'm going to leave him be because he doesn't really matter. Othar Aaron, who is the Aaron who controls the Reach at the moment because we sort of killed off all of the Tyrells. Heh, <laughs> yeah, we did, didn't we? Uh, I'm making him fourth of the Reach because his heir is the same heir as the Vale, and I do not want a dual Lord Paramount even though he's dealing with a Klansman Liberation Revolt in the Reach at the moment, I don't care. <laughs> he's going to force the Reach the Veil. He may or may not have. I don't care. I don't want him with the Reach. Alright, Martels. As much as this guy will detest me, and I will detest this dude, well, in a moment at least, at the moment he seems to be not too pissed off at me, which is alright. I'm going to leave him be, uh, because he's a highly useful diplomat, and getting rid of him as well as another Lord Paramount will cause a undue amount of trouble. Alright, the Aaron is actually in the Vale. What am I going to do about him? Well, as much of an asshole as he was during the war, uh, He's having a Klansman Liberation Revolt right now. I don't want to have a three-way civil war for the Vale. So I'm going to leave him be. Lannisters were a bit of a thorn on their side, but they weren't that much of a problem. As much as I would love to strip this from them and give it to either the Reigns of Castamir for their uh, loss, or to, say, the Cases, or the Tarbex, or more likely the Crackles, um, I'm not going to do that because, again, we've already stripped one Lord Paramountcy. Alright, what to do about the actual Targaryens themselves? Now, I want to judge them all justly since I do not incur undue amount of tyranny. I already have a large amount of tyranny because I stripped the Veil. Sorry, the Reach from the, from the Aarons. It's hard to say that the Aarons have the Reach when they usually have the Veil. Ahem. <clears throat> Uh, Darren here is going to be judged justly. People have escaped. Uh, Blood Raven tends to do that. He's a pain in my ass. Uh, Ares too, apparently. Mariah, Reyna, and Lion. Well, they're all enemies of the realm now. Connington, he's kind of amazing. Formidable fighter, brave. I'm leaving him on. Derry, sure. Riker. He's not as good, but he's still okay. And Corbray's amazing, so we're leaving him. Oh boy. Now we gotta go deal with another war. Because that's what happens when you uh, strip a Lord Paramount away. There's a small chance they will rebel and not actually uh, roll over for you. So here we go. Yet another war. Makar here. Uh, dungeon. Uh, he will be crushed. Hopefully I get some more men out of this. Uh, as much as I just want to take his head, I'm throwing him into the dungeon, or I'm going over here and bastardizing him first, which I can't do until I'm at peace. So he's in the dungeon. Also dungeon. Long live the king. Alright, per usual, the Florence are on our side. As are the Brackens. Greatest knights. Red Tusk, yeah, he'd make a good Kingsguard. Let's see if he accepts. Oh yeah, of course he does. My buddy, my pal. Which means we need a new Master at Arms. I'm going to make it a Bitter Steel because... Bitter Steel. Do I need a better reason? <laughs> Alright, let's raise up my vassals. 
I'm not going to get too many men off this, but it's enough to be worth raising. Get some men on boats. Pick an ambition. Uh, win the war, because getting more martial. Even though I'm at 37, I can always use more martial. <laughs> Alrighty. I'm going to give this to the Valerian. Advisors, Thorn, and... Crosby. I'll be merciful. Let's see who's all in my prison. Bunch of Targaryens. This nobody. I'm gonna release the nobody. It's the kingly thing to do after all. And this guy's pretty much nobody, so I'm gonna release him too. But the Targaryens are staying where they belong. Court Physician's Idol. Gotta fix that. I'm getting a better Master of Whispers for right now, because uh, the risk that somebody's about to assassinate me has probably multiplied a couple times over. Uh, Boris Brun here is not bad as a Hand of the King. Laws. I'm gonna keep Melee strong. Um, do I have better Septon? Yes, I do. Okay. Back to war. As much as I would like to make a new crown, we're already in debt and at a war again, so I'm going to uh, not do that. Darren's making a petition. Uh, they're staying exactly where they belong. Alright, people who have joined me again for this war. Strangely enough, the Peaks haven't, as much as I would like them to. Uh, but Tumbletons have, so that makes the Strickland's case for being awarded this, and the Florence case for being awarded this, and the Hightower's case for being awarded this, uh, a lot stronger, in my opinion. As much as I would love to give it to the Peaks, because he did kind of kill the last Tyrell. Anyway, we'll sort who gets this later. Ah, the Reigns have joined us. Good. Targaryens are staying in jail. I don't care that they're technically kin to me. Vacancy on the King's Guard. Ambrose, who's an amazing fighter, has been with us. Mathos, who's been with us, but I don't know him all that well. And Brandon Flowers. I'm gonna go for Ambrose. Oh, he's lustful. Eh, oh well. <laughs> These things happen. Not all your friends will just King's Guard up for you. Send those guys up. Jasper Aaron. I could end the Aaron bloodline for a moment here, but get a lot of problems. So I'm going to say... Yeah, I was just going to imprison him, because that's what you do. I want to make sure he doesn't disappear on me. Greatest knights in all the realm. Gareth the Grey has been with us this whole time, and has been a pretty decent commander. I'm going to, uh... Kingsguard him up. Alright, speaking of commanders, we need to set those. Derry. Languard. This dude. Who's Ambrose? I don't know, he's not Ambrose. He's commander of King's Landing. Mathos. And... There's a question. I'd rather have Clement because tactics are useful. Estermonts are with us. Fear the Turtle. Dame in the middle, where he belongs. Kenrick, and I'm going to not go for my mother, I'm going to go for Langward instead. And let's march. Yeah, I know I have more men waiting. Oh, no, you don't. Just noticed that. These guys are trying to be sneaky and assail in a force to try and take the King's Landing, so I'm going to hold my men here for a moment. Master strategy. Woohoo! I'm becoming more of a strategist. Oh, man, that's terrible. The Dane just got myrtleized by a one Blood Raven. Don't know what the Dane's doing in conflicts with Blood Raven. Oh, personal combat. No idea. It's Blood Raven being Blood Raven. Uh, Paps, who cares? <laughs> <laughs> there is a tiny little rock in the middle of the ocean. I can imprison you. Oh, do I have this on? No, I don't. I'm turning that on, because stop that. 
Alrighty. And marching we go. Peaks have appeared to have joined us. Yes, they have. So I might be tempted to make it the Peaks. We'll see. For all we know... Eamon. Arbitrary? No, 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 no. He's becoming brave, damn it. Ah, that's terrible. Damn it, Eamon. My sh sons are being shitty again. Such is life. Onward we will march to High Garden. Uh, try to trap these troops. Just because I want them dead. And there we go. Ah, oh, finally, I get to kill somebody. Red wine. He's crap and a drunkard. I'm the god of war. Here we go. And he runs away. Oh well. We're going to siege out Haryarden. Race is being brave. I'm pretty sure Damon here is glad that anybody is brave, even if they are just a Royce. Alrighty. We are destroying them. That's one hell of a peasant revolt in Blackhaven. I'll deal with that later. Just taking a look around the realm, such that I'm not totally distracted by this war. Uh, yeah, there's no major issuances. These guys down, because you always need more men. It's not like the Reach has any uh, limitations to how many men I can run in. Uh, the Stark just imprisoned a Bolton. And uh, Jordan just got murdered in a trial by combat. By this dude. Weird. Education for Kala. I'm still short on funds, but she is rather important because she's marrying Bittersteel, so I'm going to try to get her a decent tutor. And she'll focus on Intrigue. I know she doesn't have the stats for Intrigue, but it's what she has the uh, childhood focuses for. Old Town has joined us, meaning the previous High Tower has died and his son has kept faithful. Good to know. The Ironborn are having an issue. Good. We'll deal with them later. Uh, try to get her to become gregarious. Gluttonous. Oh, well. Damon's children are proving to be, uh, pale imitations. I'm going to retire Damon as commander for a moment, just so I can force train my children a little. My mother will take over just for now. I'm going to force train Aegon. And he got better. Back to the army we go. De -de -de -de. Um, I'm going to make it... My mother. And we're just sieging down Highgarden. Ah, that's a problem. Alright, fine. Split in half. Take the smaller one. Aubrey is fine. Mathos will be fine. Just go deal with that. I want them all dead. <laughs> Alrighty. Apparently the Royce is supposed to marry a hunter. I'm fine with that. You. You need to focus. You're Blackfire. <laughs> As for why I'm educating all my children with struggle, well, that's just fitting for the character at this point. And that makes a video. I hope you have enjoyed watching. Uh, this has been the Blackfire Crowned. We are trying to keep the realm together and, uh, well, having a bit of a scuffle with the Reach. Well, the Veilman in the Reach. He's about to lose a 36% war score and we're halfway to taking Highgarden. I hope to see you all next time. This has been Strategist Primus and the Blackfires. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed this content. I will see you all later.